At the turn of the 20th century, Kitty Hawk wasn't much more than just a place to go fishing. But two brothers saw its open space and soft dunes as the perfect spot to experiment with their flying machines. Wilbur and Orville Wright, who ran a bicycle shop in Ohio, spent their winters down here. In wooden shacks like these, they lived humbly and worked on a series of primitive gliders. In the winter of 1903, they were finally prepared to take to the air in an engine-powered craft. On December 14th, after a coin toss, Wilbur won the privilege of piloting their new Wright Flyer down this path. But instead of catching air, he oversteered the plane, which dove into the sand before it could take off. Three days later, Orville was in the pilot's seat for his short but historic flight. For 12 incredible seconds, at this exact location, human flight went from fantasy to reality. The Wright's flyer traveled just 120 feet, but its impact was felt around the world. In the distance on Big Kill Devil Hill stands the 60-foot Wright Brothers Monument. Dedicated in 1932, it bears the inscription, in commemoration of the conquest of the air by the brothers Orville and Wilbur Wright, conceived by genius, achieved by dauntless resolution and unconquerable faith. <laughs>